Thank you so much for watching Tomoshi the Music. Today, I'm going to show you how to play Confirmation by Charlie Parker, a great song. I have this song on Guitar Wisdom Jazz Standard section, how to play Route 37, just like that, and really, really great chord changes. If you like blues, jazz blues, this is next level after the jazz blues, a little bit more sophisticated, but I love playing walking bass line and root 37. Root 37 is really simple. If you play from fifth string, you play root and major third and fifth. So first you have to learn what sounds like, what shape like, but then here, you know, eighth fret, seventh fret, and ninth. So root, major third, and major seven. So if you change to this, you know, eight, seven, eight, then that's, now you have dominant seven, root, major third, flat seven. So you have to know just a little bit theory. So this is like, you know, it's not advanced, but intermediate kind of level right now. Now, if you wanna make minor third, you make like, this, just change fingering, root, flat three, flat seven. So you have to know only three shapes, see? Minor, dominant, major seven. Okay? Now, if you play, say, B flat, if you, know, you play B flat blues, so from six string root, you go root, then if you play major third, a little too close, you skip that, you go to flat seven in this case. You know? So now six, six, and seven, which is major third, root, flat seven, major third. If you do this, root, major seven, major third. So that's the theory part, you have to understand. Dominant seven. Same fingering. Two, three, four fingering. This is root, flat seven, flat three. So minor, minor seven. Minor seven, dominant seven, major seven. The first chord, F major seven. Okay, then E minor seven flat five to A seven, you don't play minor seven flat five, omit to the fifth. So you just, you know, play minor seven, E minor seven, seven, five, seven, yeah. Then A seven, simple. You, you know, five, five, six, the same shape, see? D minor seven, G seven. And you can go to B, C, C minor to F, but you change position. Because that's a little too low. Like that. C minor seven, F seven. B flat major seven, or I put a major six. On. Then quick two five. A minor seven, D seven. And the G seven. Nice. Secondary dominant, that we call. We skip the theory part today, but C seven. Same thing. So one more time. Then repeat. Very nice. Then, then here, two five. G minor, C seven, and F major seven. So now, idea is A A. You know, A form and another A form. The B, B, B section, different keys. C minor 7, F7. So that's 2 5 into B flat, which is 4 chord. Very popular in the chord, you know, structure. 2 5 into 4. Now, a little bit of key change. 2 5 into D flat. So now here, E flat minor 7. 
A flat seven, D flat major seven. Then two five back to key of F. Or the same thing. So up to here. E flat minor seven. Top A A sec. Nice. Like that. So you see, you play root third or seven, but idea is when from we play from fifth fifth string root, you play root third seven. When you play from 6th string root, you skip 5th string, you only use 6th, 4th, 3rd. So you go root, 7th, 3rd. That's a little bit tricky part. Then you learn that. Simple rhythm, like ta 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 ta. I don't know why they call Char Charleston beat. Somebody named for a Charleston invented this beat, like the jazz beat, basic jazz beat. Ta, so ta ta ta. Sometimes. Let's listen to this difference. So first one, a little shorter. Let me play a little slower, maybe 60. A one, two, three, four. And one more, little longer, last one.
something like that. Okay, I think you got it, right? So if you want to learn more, I teach you everything at the Gita Wisdom too. You know, that's up to you and more detail there. And But here already you can learn. You just need a basic charts from real book to see confirmation, follow the chord changes, you know, just root 37. Thank you so much for watching Tomofujita Music. If you like my channel, please subscribe Tomofujita Music. Please share with your friends. That would be really wonderful. I really appreciate all your comments. I love reading all your comments. Thank you. Everything so good. Alright, so see you next time. Thank you.